The world watched as Tasha Adams fell in love and got engaged to Zach on this season of The Bachelorette. Now the happy couple is talking to people all about life after the show, including Tasha's big move to Zach's New York City home. We're gonna spend the holidays out there. She's gonna have a one-way ticket. We're gonna get comfortable. <laughs> She's gotta learn the subway system and we saw her learn to hail a cab. And so yeah. there's some things that, <laughs> you know, New York living that she's got to get accustomed to. And we're going to see where it goes from there. I mean, I'll still have my apartment here, so I'll live by coastally, but that's the plan. Now that they're away from the cameras, the lovebirds tell us they're having so much fun learning new things about each other. This guy is so weird. <laughs> And I love it, but he is just—he just has like the strangest dance moves. Like he'll just like wake up and start like cha chaing and just being like, "I love today. Like today is such a good day." Like what? Like who are you? What else do you do? That's so bizarre. Um, I don't know. Yeah, look at him. <laughs> I have some fun, all right. He's he's um, he's also a clean freak, which is actually really cool. He like will pack my bags for me or like unpack them. Like he's. I'm not like that. And he like puts all of his clothes away in the closet. The best thing for me, and this is because she's going to think I'm a total mush, but like oh, the reasons I fell in love with her on the show have remained true when the cameras are not around. You know, she's not afraid to speak her mind. She's very honest. She's a fighter. She's not going to back down in a conversation where she thinks that like, you know, she's uh, not, not even right, but like not being understood. And I appreciate that personally because I feel like there's too many relationships even just friendships that I've been a part of where there's not that level of honesty. And they aren't rushing down the aisle, but they definitely enjoy talking about their future and kids. I just ask them like to date me. Like, I just want to be dated. You know what I mean? Like we already have this, like that's all sorted out. Um, I'm not going anywhere. He's not going anywhere. So I think that that's like a really fun, well, it's, not, it's not fun, but it's an amazing sense of security that you don't really have to worry about. And um, I just want to be dated. And he asked me for the same thing. So we're just going to probably have fun for the next year or so. We're not rushing. She wants 17 children. So <laughs> if we're going to if we're gonna reach her goals, we better get to work soon here. <laughs> that makes me laugh. I, I'm serious. In a perfect world, I would love to have five children. But, and he didn't shy away from that. Let's go.